Hi everyone, thanks for watching. Today is day 48 of my 100 day challenge. I know I've showed you the cold brew before, but we are going to make candy cane cold brew today. Um, and tomorrow I'm gonna have a cold brew candy cane latte. I'm super excited about that. Um, so cold brew is different than iced coffee. Cold brew is less acidic than um, uh, hot coffee or iced coffee because iced coffee is just actually coffee brewed with hot water and then chilled and poured over ice. Sometimes it's not even chilled. You can just pour it hot over the ice and it cools. And um, cold brew is actually brewed um, with cold water, room temperature for um, eight to 12 hours. You can even brew it up to 24 hours. I wouldn't do it any more than that. Um, it is less acidic, so it's easier on your tummy. It's easier on your teeth. Um, it's, um, I know there's another thing too, can't, can't remember it right now, uh, but it is, it's a lot easier. Um, if you get acid reflux from coffee, um, less chance of it happening with this. It comes with really nice um, carafe on the cover. And this carafe is, it looks like it's glass. It's not glass. It's a really, really nice plastic. Um, so yeah, it stays pretty looking for years. I don't put mine in the dishwasher. I just wash it by hand. And that way it stays uh, looking nice longer. And then the filter is this really fine mesh. And so I just wash this with the bottle brush and um, that's it. And you can do tea. There's lines on this as well. Uh, this bottom line down here is if you want ready to drink coffee, the, no, yes, that, that line down there is ready to drink. If you fill it up to this line, then that's a, going to be a cold brew concentrate. And then you fill it up to this line with your water. So, um, and if you're doing tea, I um, do it about halfway to the first line. They say to do it all the way to the first line. I don't think you need that much. I think about halfway is good and fill it up with water. And I actually, once I take this out um, with, just with a cold brew tea, not with coffee, I just fill it up um, when I take the filter out and I let it drain, let it drip like this for a few minutes. And then you let it sit on the cover and this cover doubles as a coaster. Um, then just for tea, I fill it up to the top with water. Uh, with coffee, I don't fill. Um, so I'm just gonna show you quickly how to make a candy cane cold brew. So I just ground some coffee and do it coarse grind or even medium is fine. Uh, don't do fine grind though. And I just got some little candy canes. I broke them up just into pieces. And then we're just gonna put some of the coffee in here. And then I'm gonna put a couple pieces of candy cane in here. And I'll put some more coffee. And I'm gonna do a concentrate. Um, because then we can add um, some water to it as we go along and we can, um, that way it makes a nicer latte too. Sometimes if you just do a ready to drink and then you want to do a lot of milk in it, um, it won't be as strong and we like our coffee strong in this house. So um, sometimes a little bit too strong, but people can always water it down, right? And it's hard to add more to it, but you can always water it down or make it less strong with milk. So I'm just gonna top this up, all the little bits. And it's just about up to that top line now. Then we're just gonna add, slowly add, I don't know if you can see in here, but the coffee is up to there. And I've been just sort of alternating the candy canes with that. And I've done it with cinnamon before. You can put cinnamon sticks in there. It's really super nice. Um, do it with anything. You shouldn't put citrus in here. Um, I do do an orange tea uh, that's a cold brew. Um, but there's a danger if you do citrus in here that it will, um, it'll wreck the finish on the carafe. So you don't really want to do that. Um, yeah, so just like that. And you can see it's changing color already. And tomorrow, um, I don't even know what time it is. Tomorrow, yeah, by the time we get up in the morning, it'll be ready, actually, because it's seven now. So seven in the morning, we might be having candy cane lattes for breakfast. 
that would be pretty good. And there we go. Just about up to the top line. And so what I will do is I will post a picture of the of the latte in the comments on my VIP group tomorrow. So like, share, comment. If you would like um, the recipe, head over. Oh, I shouldn't have moved it out of the way. If you'd like the recipe, uh, join my Tupperware VIP page and ask me for the recipe. And I'm just going to put the cover on. I'm going to let it sit. Thanks for watching.